Mate, I love this Corolla. The Corolla is easily the coolest hatchback right now. Gia Yaris, pff, bin. There's just something about it that's so spicy. Is it because I am a Toyota fanboy? B partly, maybe part of it. But it just looks so good. Now, this is a wide body version. I'm already dutting this thing up. It is ridiculous. And I, I felt we haven't really tried much off-road with the handling mods and need for speed. So I'm super curious how it actually feels to off-road compared to Unbound, which I guess I've done no off-road whatsoever. Why is it in the game? I don't think I've ever driven this long path before <laughs> off-road. Why have I never experienced it? It seems to go through the whole bloody map. Oh, and one other thing I figured out about this car, you may notice there's something following me. I don't know if they realize <laughs> the mod creator, but there's something following me. This, once again, this is stolen from Horizon Fire. I can't call a third video in a row stolen, but it is stolen. Now, I've got some good news and some news. Basically, this thing is gonna have some customization. Now, I don't know how well it's gonna work, but in case you hadn't realized, these are Honda wheels. It replaces the 2015 Honda, which I do not care. Goodbye to the Honda. It does my head in. Give us the new damn Honda, please. But we will change those and we will fix the fitment. Of course, it's horrendous. Don't worry. Now, how do I fix the issue of the thing? Is it still over there? I can't even see it. Fantastic. I guess I'll put the other piece on and hope for the best. Now, something we do need to do is uh, go through the diffusers. Yeah, okay, nothing. The exhausts, I do know, do work. They may not fit perfectly, but we can go for the carbon ones. And that is enough for me. Where are my flames? Tail like... <laughs> what the hell? Uh, yes, my Honda, my Honda appears to be broken. Um, so they've just like flattened it to, to hide the fact that it's not... I don't think I've ever seen that. That... Is genius. Can I drive it like this? Yo, look at the whip. <laughs> Yo, let's go. Sitting on my Honda, riding on my whip like. I can't believe it. The, the exhaust still work. The lights still work. I <laughs> can turn the headlights off. This is incredible. I've made a Honda go-kart. I'm Evan Shanks. I beat you to it. <laughs> I just love as well <laughs> that the seatbelt is still attached to nothing. But it's still there. Mate, if you customize it, the parts still get... <laughs> I like that laugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. How did I do this? Oh, no. What part was it? It wasn't the exhaust. It was the lights. All right. We're good. We're good. All right. Let's fix that fitment. We're going to have to put some camber on it. Oh, no. What a shame. Please, please, please. Listen, this is a problem that could have a nice big old splitter there. From bumper does nothing. HUD does nothing because all the customization that's happening is literally in that squished version of the Honda underneath our car. We have got two in one. This is incredible. <laughs> Spot yes! Okay, I'm happy. We actually have two chassis mount wings on this boy. Oh my God. Is that an intake? Holy crap. I have concluded this is the best car mod. I've just changed the sound to be more aggressive and it is so raspy now. Proper Honda business, but that is craziness. But it doesn't quite fit as good as the Carbon Boys. I put some meaty off-road wheels on it because it just fits perfectly. Look how aggressive. But I will be changing the stance. Oh, it's an off-road car. Maybe I won't. <laughs> Get that rear fitment out a little bit. Oh, oh, I love front fitment. <laughs> Engine-wise. I'm pretty much decided on the Mitsubishi Forged 4B11. Reason is four cylinder just makes the most sense for this car. And you already know, we ain't playing no damn games. We are going elite. I mean, ultimate. I'm playing the wrong game in my head. In my head, I want to go supercharger just because this is going to be a rally boy, which means we're going to build it a little bit differently. So let's go full rally suspension. That makes the most sense. I've also put it in my favorite Corolla color. If we actually got the proper Corolla, I would maybe have one. Rally tires, very epic. And of course, clutching. See, I actually only think I have one rally event because there's normally quite a lot more, which tells me that, yeah, I, uh, I haven't done her missions on PC. I avoided it where humanly possible. Right, we're going the wrong way. Fantastic start. What is this? 
is living up to its formula drift nature, that's for sure. It's just not ready. I do want to know what the hell that rear crash bar thing. Is it a crash bar? Because if so, if we remove the rear bumper of the Honda, we might be... Oh my... What am I looking at? Could I have teleported to the garage to get there? Yes. Am I only now just realizing that? Yes. Do I play more Need for Speed Unbound than Heat? Clearly. <laughs> right now. Will Unbound get updated? Please hold. Let's wait a few weeks and find out. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so I've not really experienced the off-road in terms of the Unite mod, but... It definitely feels like an afterthought. I don't think there's really any differences, to be honest with you. But this track will tell us exactly. Thankfully, it's one of my favorites. Said absolutely nobody ever in the history of Need for Speed. I really like that off-road track. <laughs> Whoa, what a machine. Oh, this is going to be sick. Look at the Raptor, the red versus blue. That looks beautiful. Oh my God, it's ASAP. AMG. <laughs> I don't know. Right, we got a big old boost. Christ, this thing's lift has really done some bigness to it, that's for sure. Now, straight away, I feel like I have crazy amounts of grip compared to what we used to have. <laughs> so much so that I can't focus on my bloody language. I said had. What? Okay, it's not me. It's not just me that just had that massive accident. Everybody span hugely. Everybody's gone. <laughs> They've gone off the track. Maybe the Unite people didn't try the off-road. Potentially. <laughs> I'm understeering, but also then instantly oversteer. It feels just like the drifting. That's mostly what it feels like. The newfound oversteer, understeer situation for the skip. Help! Back on track, back on track. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, live tuning. Downforce. Uh, help. I just increased the brake pressure. I think that's all. <laughs> that's all she wrote. I remember the base off-roading not being horrendous. I think, if anything, it might be one of the better handling <laughs> in this game because it makes sense. You slide around. It's off-road. It makes sense. This man's flip-flopping all over. That is a loud GTI. I didn't know what the hell that was for a second there. But he's got some soul in him. He's speaking out loud to us, letting us know that he could take me if this was on road. Yeah, I know that, Mr. Golf. Uh, <laughs> please. I oh, know you couldn't, because you're not driving a straight line. Neither can I. Oh, for God's sake. Yeah, that's what... What? No. <laughs> oh, I should... Don't nos. That's a tip for you. You're so welcome. Slow down. Go nice and steady. How about we don't drift? For God's sake, I didn't ask. It's good. It's good. Forwards. Now I can nos. Right at the end. No. No. Wow. Who would have thought that the off-roading is still shite? Not me. I, no. <laughs> not, not, not 15 grand. Come on. See, what I don't understand is why it feels like it would be better at a drift event. I mean, I guess we put off-road tires and stuff and drift stuff sometimes. Like, that That makes it... But speaking of, is this spring... No, it's not spring bark, but it is, however, a drift event. And I'm kind of tempted, even though we're fully off-road set up, to giving this a whirl and seeing how it does. It's a formula drift car. It looks better without all the sponsors and stuff on it. What is it with clean cars? I mean, we, we all know. It just looks clean. <laughs> I promise you, I have not lost it, all right? This is just my uh, <laughs> my mentality when it comes to driving stupid cars. All right, get, get that drift going. All right, maybe, maybe we do some live tuning. We've got the brake pressure all the way on high. Brake balance, let's go all the way to the front. That's the perfect setup, right? But do I even use the brake? No. <laughs> Help! A nice simple objective of 190,000 on the points. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, you know what? When it comes to the actual drifting, I prefer this. This feels more correct. I can fail at any point, but it's still arcade fun. I've messed it. Here we go. Oh. My goodness. I think the differential is all-wheel drive off-road. May have been a better choice to, <laughs> to change the setup. We can do so on the fly, so what? 
Why didn't I do that? I've got unbound in my brain. My brain just says I can't change parts unless I go back to the garage and it's going to change the time of day. I think that definitely frustrates me when I want to play in the daytime because I can actually see quite a lot better. And I go, yeah, yeah, I want to change car as well. I could do it at the meetup. Yeah. But if I want to change parts, then I'm a little bit stuck on that. Target score hit. The off-road boy that I built. The FD car. Who would have thought? is actually better at drifting. Hmm. <laughs> the wheels spin so good. So, so good. It also looks like I know what I'm doing. Mom, get the camera. No, I was just saying. The points drifting is so much better. I want more of that. He's ruined it. I kept my points. So much better. <laughs> Sorry. I want them to change it back. I know I know why it was as it was. They just last minute heard our panics about the no drifting and then they just took the ASAP Rocky showcase events and decided, yeah, yeah, yeah. We have drifting, no worry, no worry. Yeah, maybe you should redo it. Maybe in an update. I'm hoping and praying a little bit too much from this game, I think. <laughs> All right, thanks so much for watching this video. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you want to check out this mod in the description, check out this video on Need for Speed Heat. Smash like, subscribe if you are new, and peace.